We'll guide you through how to fix AirPods won't connect or pair to an Android. If you find this useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. This problem can be really annoying as you're then unable to go and connect to them and play sound through them. So you've got some different fixes you can try. Of course, first of all, make sure they've got charge. You know that as when you go and open up the case, a light will go and appear. The next thing you want to do is make sure they're both in the case like so. We'll just close the lid again and go and open up the settings on your Android, press connections at the top and press Bluetooth. Now you need to make sure they're in pairing mode. If they aren't, that's why you can't connect. Go and open up the case and you should see the light there. What you want to do is if there's no button on the back, double tap on the light and it should then start glowing white. If there is a button, tap and hold it on the back until it starts glowing white. Then what you can do is on your device, they should then go and appear. You may need to go and press scan in the top right. If you're finding they aren't showing up or they still won't go and connect, then what we can try doing is a reset. To do that, if there's no button on the back, open up the lid like so, double tap on the light. It will start glowing white, double tap again, and then again. It will then beep and start glowing orange. This means they're being reset. If there is a button, then all you need to do is go and hold down the button and watch the light on the front until it goes and turns orange. That means it's being reset. When it starts glowing white, that means they've been reset. We can try scanning again here. And as you can see, they're now showing up and we can go and connect and pair. We can confirm the request and that's it. Hopefully that solved the problem. If it still hasn't, you can try restarting the Android. To do that, hold the side power button like so. And then what you can do is press restart and you can then press restart again to confirm. When it starts again, put them into pairing mode as I showed you. And then you can try connecting and that should hopefully solve the problem.